Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be talking about side hustles and ways that you can make extra money in 2020. The definition of a side hustle would be making money from something that isn't your main job. So there's so many ideas these days, especially in this digital age, ways that you can make extra money and extra income and also ways that you can make a passive income, which is basically something that just makes money in the background without having to do a load to it. I would really love it if you wanted to leave some comments down below of extra side hustles that you do to make extra money because when people are reading the comments it's really really helpful to get even more information than I've shared. I'm going to be blasting through them because there's quite a few here but the one disclaimer I want to say is that make sure you know the tax implications if you are doing a side hustle. That means obviously you need to be disclosing it if you're making extra income from a side hustle so make sure you are being responsible for that and doing it uh, according to the law. If you're making under £12,000, I don't think that it is taxable, but you do still need to register it as a business. So anyway, without further ado, let's get into the video and share some side hustles for 2020. Okay, the first one I'm gonna say is because I've already done a video on it, the entire process of how to do eBay is to sell things on eBay. I will leave that video link down below, but be aware there are a lot of costs to selling on eBay, which leads me nicely to my number two side hustle, is selling things on a local Facebook marketplace or online like Gumtree, so you don't actually have to pay hefty charges that eBay will, will charge you. You can take the photos easily from your room you know of the item list it people can come and get it which is a great thing if you're listing heavy things or big things and that it's so much easier just for someone to pop over and buy it the next side hustle for 2020 is become a dog sitter slash cat sitter slash dog walker there's so many things that you can do you can register yourself you can i think there's a site called rover there's also borrow my doggy i don't think that's a paid for thing but there's loads of ways that you can make money and of course you're getting exercise as as well some people will even pay you to go and live in their house for a week where they go on holiday and you just look after their dog I mean that sounds amazing you can travel around the world and you can look after dogs it sounds win-win the next way is of course to get a part-time job it doesn't have to be a side hustle where you're making something your own you could go and get a part-time job in Sainsbury's or in Pizza Express or something like that so that you're actually working in the evenings as well as your other job if you can find the time or the energy because let's be real I'm exhausted by the time the day is over. I don't want to go back out to work. But it's a great way of making extra income if you need some money quickly. The next way is to create a an Airbnb. So whether you're leasing out your spare room or um, maybe you can design something in your garden to have as a guest room or something like that. It's a really easy way to make money and you can use it ad hoc whenever you like. The next side hustle for 2020 is matched betting. Now this is not gambling. This is a no risk uh, method to someone's washing their car sorry guys <laughs> also another side hustle wash someone's car um, so match betting is a no risk non gambling method of making extra money by using a very technical method of doing it I signed up I couldn't make head nor tail it's just not the way my brain works so I didn't use it but it's a very good way of doing it if you are looking to there's a website called profit accumulator which I used they do give you lots of support and it's a free account to use as well so it's free and you can just deposit 10 pounds and try and make some money out of it without any risk of losing it the next thing is uber you can drive people around if you have uber in your town and obviously just do it ad hoc whenever you can and obviously make just a little bit of extra income that way the next thing is to deliver food so uber eats or deliveroo and i think postmates in america as well is a great way of just delivering items to people uh, so quite a few overheads in terms of the petrol and the insurance and the car but if you're doing it anyway you've got a spare evening twice a week three times a week you could easily make an extra 200 pounds a week in doing this and have that extra 500 quid 600 700 quid a month just for doing delivering of food and i think you also get a free meal the next thing is to teach english online as a course so if your first language is english you can teach other people english and get paid to do so that's a really nice way of doing things because you're helping someone and you're also getting paid for it the next one is to rent out your parking space so really great if you live near a festival location or a campsite or somewhere where people have to pay extra for parking rent out your garage or even 
Uh, if you live near the city and you're not there all day or you don't drive, rent out your driveway and you can make loads of extra money that way. The next thing is to do mystery shopping. There's absolutely loads of websites online, so just Google it and you can sign up and do uh, surveys or um, test out the way that shops run or restaurants and you get free meals and you're getting paid for it as well. The next way is affiliate marketing. Now, if you do have a YouTube channel or an Instagram or a blog, you can set up affiliate links for things that you recommend which you need to disclose, but it basically doesn't charge any the person buying it any extra money, but it does mean that you get a percentage commission, very, very small, uh, but they, they do add up if you sell a lot of things, just for um, kind of as a thank you for the person that you've given that inspiration to. If they buy it using your link, you'll get a small commission, and that is affiliate marketing. It's not any way charged extra to the customer, to you and I, uh, but if you swipe up on someone's stories because you want something that they've, they've got, even though you've slept on it and you know you can afford it and all my usual rules, um, it just means that you're giving them a little bit of commission for helping you find that item. The next one is to sell your phone photos onto an app where people can buy them to use as stock images or anything like that. Obviously be mindful, don't share pictures of your children potentially, but you can sell it on an app and it's so easy to upload and then just make money that way. Another side hustle for 2020 is to sell graphic digital products, not graphic, graphics. <laughs> So you can sell things like presets or graphical designs, anything like that. You can sell as um, on Etsy or somewhere like that, a marketplace, and quite simple to design if you're into that and people pay good money for them. The next one is to proofread. It's good, easy money if you're good at spotting mistakes and you're concentrating on large bodies of work. Uh, just sign up for proofreading online and you can make extra money that way. The next side hustle for 2020, let's take it back a few years and do some babysitting because people want reliable, friendly, trustworthy people and if that is you and you've got your weekend spare and you want to make some extra money then why not help out parents that need it and offer your services as a babysitter. The next one is Depop, so obviously eBay, but if you want to sell clothes and things like that, you can use Depop, and I think there's others. Let me know if you know of any others, uh, clothes selling sites. I'm really bad, I usually just give everything to charity, but I feel like I just prefer to do that, and my clothes were never that expensive anyway to sell on Depop, but people do, and they make an absolute fortune. The next one is cleaner. You can do this in your evenings twice a week, or you know, two hours a night if you wanted to do commercial clean, or if you've got children at school or something, you can just do it in the daytime for people's homes. There's loads of different options, and obviously you can make extra money that way. Another similar way is being a handyman. If you've got a few skills and you wanna do different bits and bobs around other people's houses, just create a website and list it on a kind of checker trade type site and use your skills to help other people whether it's just mend you know a fence or um if you've you know retired and you've got a degree, a degree like qualifications in being an electrician or something like that you can use your services to make money that way and very similar again is a landscaper people love that kind of thing because sometimes they just don't want to do their own garden and you can just you know do odd jobs around, even if just mowing the lawn for people and, and make extra income that way. The next way is to start a blog. I started my blog in 2013, no, 2012, long time ago now, and it's just somewhere that I love to document our lives and share our story. It's adventuresofamum.com, and I do lots of similar content over there than you'll see here, but different. Uh, but you can start a blog and eventually you may well be able to monetize it and work with brands that way as well and make some extra money. And of course, you can also use affiliate links there as well, if you disclose them. The next one is trading shares. Now, obviously this does come with a risk, so please be careful and don't use money that you can't afford to lose. I'm actually doing it with an app that I've been using recently, which I'm gonna be talking to you about soon because I've been really enjoying how easy it is to learn on like just with a few pounds here and there. So there's not much risk, or there's not much money that you can lose, um, but it kind of does it all for you. So if you're ready, can look into it and look into like how to properly do trading shares, then do so. But if not, there are other ways of doing it and I will let you know what I've been doing recently in an upcoming video. The next thing is to make things and sell them on Etsy or Facebook Marketplace. And if you've got a skill of any, any sort, you know, you could make, you can't see that, that's my little, um, flag from the Himalayas but you know anything around these bubble lights people make brands all the time Instagram's an amazing place to sell them as well just a really nice way of making extra income by creating things that you enjoy making the next side hustle is to learn a skill and then teach someone it it's a really simple com concept of how to make money 
but it's a great way of doing it if you've got extra time on your hands. The next side hustle is to become a virtual assistant. A lot of people in the kind of content creation space, creation space, or you know anyone that works online sometimes could do with a virtual assistant. You don't even have to work online. It could be you're an accountant and you need an assistant. So a great way of making extra money with the some spare time that you may have. And the final one is social media management. I used to do this when George was seven months. I did it for a year and for a lovely baby company and it was a great way of making money without having to kind of be at the office every day. I did one day a week and the rest of it was at home. So it's really flexible, really great way. That was my actual, I guess it was my side hustle because I was doing YouTube at the time. Um, but neither of them were making me much money. But yeah, it's a great way of making money if you have some extra time on your hand. So that is it guys. Sorry it was a bit quick, but I just wanted to blast through them all like I said. I really hope you gained something from this video and it was valuable to you. If it was, why not share it with someone that you think might be find it useful. And of course, don't forget to subscribe for three videos a week, every week. Thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to add your own side hustles in the description bar. But for now, that is all. Thank you, I'll see you soon. Bye.